still smoking on airplanes. I know. It's ridiculous, isn't it? Don't worry about it. I'll be quick. Sir, if you like that, I'll have to report you to the FAA. Stacy, do you know when the first commercial flight went smokeless? No. 1973. And did you know that in 1969, when smoking was allowed on all flights, we put a man on the moon? I had no idea. Look. You know what that is? That's a remnant of a better time. But they welded it shut. And it starts with ashtrays, and it ends with all of our precious freedoms being stripped away. <laughs> I remember back in the day when you got on a plane and you knew you were in for a good time. A little smoking, a little drinking. And the stewardesses, Stacy, you come from a proud tradition of blazing hot stewardesses. <laughs> And now you can't do one damn thing without someone reporting you to the Department of Homeland Security. Am I right? Right. You listen to Don. I had to take my pants off and nibble my old spice down to three ounces just to get on the plane, Stacy. They made me throw out my mouthwash. I had to give up my bath jellies. They made me breastfeed some old man. That's what I'm talking about. But we don't have to take it, Stacy. Like Henry David Thoreau and Rosa Parks and David Lee Roth when he left Van Halen, we can say enough. Enough injustice. And when you and I are old and gray, we can look back on this and remember when we were 30,000 feet above God's green earth and we smoked one. We smoked one for America! You motherfucker. Well, this is one of my favorite movies. I think you could understand why. Selling is about motivating. And we just saw a perfect example of a motivator, right? You need to motivate your buyer. Motivate them by recognizing their profession. Motivate them by recognizing their place in the community. You need to motivate them by recognizing them as, a, as people who can afford your product. You know, recognize their buying power, the fact that they're free to choose whatever they want, the fact that they can get what they finally deserve. Expand the pie a little bit. Move them into a state where they can see and feel and experience what it is like to own your product. You need to motivate your buyers. To learn more, follow me at velcosalestraining.com and I will give you the solutions you've been looking for.